Taurus, hello and welcome. Here are your cards for this week. You have the reverse King of Cups, reversed the Mist, the Libra, reversed the Earthly, the Sand, and the Shadow, reversed. Alright Taurus, my friends, your King of Cups here in reversed. It's giving me the feeling that you have been stuck, right? In a situation that you just feel unfulfilled in. I cannot tell for certain if this is pertaining to work, right? All I can say is that I, I feel, right, that you have been feeling unfulfilled. You have been trying to get out of the situation because you want to make yourself feel something. You want to feel, you want to feel successful. You want to feel loved. You want to feel seen. But the King of Cups here is saying that that is not what's happening right now. And you are just stuck in a hole where you feel unseen, you feel unappreciated, or you feel unfulfilled, right? And because of that feeling of unfulfillment, you have been doing some stuff, right? That's causing you to, in a lack of a better term, you are spiraling out of control. And that is not something that you should do. You have to take control of yourself, my friends. I know that it is hard to be stuck in a situation where you are safe, but you do not feel any fulfillment from this place. You may not be in a bad place right now, you may not be in a bad situation, but you just feel like you're tired of this place. You want to get out of this place. And so you are resorting to... You're resorting to... Um, what is that term? You're desperate to get out of it. So you are doing a lot of things, right? To get, you out, to get yourself out of that place. But those things that you're doing, they're kind of destructive, so to speak. It's... You're not doing any favor for yourself by doing those things but you're pretty much just making your situation worse than it is, right? So here's what you have to do this week, my friends, right? You have to slow down. First of all, you have to slow down. And you also have to see yourself, right? You have to see yourself as a powerful person despite not being in a place where you want to be. You have to see yourself, right, as a person who is blessed to have what you have right now, right? This place that you're in, you may not see it as a fulfilling place, but put yourself in another person's shoes. Is your situation a situation that someone else wish, wishes they had? Think of it that way, my friends. You have to see things, right? In different perspectives. In other words, don't be, don't be selfish in a way that you only see yourself right you only see you only see yourself you have to see your situation as something that may not be so bad after all right is this place that you're in really a horrible place or you just feel like it is a horrible place because you are not happy there even though this place is not harming you right even though this place right the situation that you're in it is not breaking you apart you just feel unhappy there so my friends, being happy is important, right? But also we have to be appreciative of what we have, right? It's okay to dream of bigger things, but it's, it becomes bad when you become so desperate to get those things that you become destructive, right? So I guess the point here that the cards are trying to say is ground yourself, right? Ground yourself in reality and ask yourself, am I really in a bad situation? Or am I just making it bad in my head, right? So here, here's what you need to do, my friends. If you really want to get out of the situation of this hole that you're in, right? The sand here, right? It's so funny that the sand card here, it's saying that do things slowly, right? To fill up that hole so you can dig yourself out of there. But do things um, one small step at a time. Don't give in to desperation, okay? Just do things one step at a time and you will surely see yourself out of this hole. And the shadow card here in reverse in the last of your card, right? This is talking about your mindset right now. 
you are shrouded, right? You are your mindset is being shrouded by something. It is not clear to me what is shrouding your mind. Could be that you are you want more out of this life. However, right? You are failing to see that your place in this world at the moment isn't so bad after all. So if you are one of those Tauruses, right, who are trying to get out of a hole because you are feeling unhappy, this hole, right, this might not even be an actual hole. This might be a hole that you conjured up in your head to define the situation that you're in. Because I feel that your situation isn't so bad after all, but this could just be a general, this is a general reading after all, but I am sensing that some of you are not in a bad spot at all, but you just want to get out of there because you have a lot of goals, a lot of dreams that you want to achieve, and that's shrouding your mind from appreciating what you already have right now, okay? so. If this reading resonated with you, my friends, consider subscribing and liking, and I shall see you next week.